this is the most forgotten element in the Capoeira game. And you may have done it, you may have practiced it, but do you incorporate it daily or maybe weekly into your training? You know what it is? It's the improvised movements, the dancing, the faking, the provoking. Yes, here's an example of how I tend to do it. One big mistake that teachers and students are making is that you just do it. Like, okay, move, improvise, just dance. Now, it doesn't happen like that. You need some guidance, you need some building blocks to actually do it. Now, here are some building blocks, yeah? So, here I start with uh, my classic left, right. And you can personalize this easily. Now, this is also a nice one. Just balancing on your toes another classic is the giro you're spinning around in different forms in different ways and a third one i really like i did in my own uh, flow is standing on your heels now this is really an awkward off balance kind of thing but it works because you can keep your balance this is the key pretending that you lose balance but actually controlling that fake of losing balance and move it into an actual movement. So the most forgotten element of capoeira, the jogo di corpo, the dancing, the play with your body, the provoking. Put this into your training and let me know how you go, yes? My name is Vita, aka Arnold. Improve your capoeira, connect and play. Ciao!